Okay, so I think I figured it out. Going to make a couple of uh, droppers. Well, I've got too much stuff on me. <laughs> Don't think I'll be needing the buckets anytime soon. Okay, so I'm going to make a few hoppers. And then I need some uh, comparators and some repeaters. So I'm going to make a couple. I don't know exactly uh, how many I need. So I'll just make a few. Four, five. That's hoppers. And then... Oh man, it's been a while. Um, I'll just make five. Now if I remember it correctly, yeah, this is a repeater. So that's a repeater, and then I need the the new comparator. That's a little bit more expensive, I think. Well, first you have to go to the nether to get the nether quartz, which is pain. Okay, so... Comparator, redstone repeater, hopper, and then I need droppers. Why am I still clicking? Droppers, all right. Um, almost. There we go. Five droppers, hoppers. I only need one hopper, I think. Uh, no, I need a few more. Man, my brain isn't working today. Sorry. Bear with me, okay? Okay. Well, one thing that's working: the trees are growing. <laughs> Is he speaking Dutch? Yes, he is. Okay, so... It's down here. Just drop down like this. Yeah, okay. So the plan is to have a hopper down here. That will collect the items and then I want to transport them over here. Uh, let's see, this is in front of the pressure plate. That's the pressure plate. And then this is the door. So that means this is the block next to the door. And this is the first block underneath the fence. Mm, yeah, it is. Oop, I took the wall down. Got too much stuff on me. Okay, so let's put up a torch. Go put the wall back. Oh, it's going to be become a chest later on. So I need a hopper. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, that might actually work. Now I've never used these hoppers before. I've used hoppers in Feed the Beast, obviously. Okay, so this is going to be a dropper and a hopper. So I'm just hoping that when I place them like this, uh, when an item comes along, so go into the first, second, and then into the dropper. Okay, so it's in the, this item hopper now. Okay, so I'm obviously not doing it right. I 
thought it was just add them to the next block. Yeah, that's connected at the bottom. Yeah, if you want a decent redstone tutorial, don't watch me. <laughs> okay, let's try it again. In it goes. Through there, through here, through that one. Okay, it's in the dropper, so that's working. Now, what I need to do next is dig out a little bit of space. Can we turn left? Yeah, we can. Because I'm also going to use another block, the redstone comparator. So we put that here. And then when an item enters the dropper, it should give a redstone signal, which will then power this block, which will then power the redstone, which will then power this repeater. My Skype. Yeah, that's a well-kept secret. <laughs> okay, so when an item goes in here, it will give the redstone signal to the comparator. I hope this is the right way around. Power the block, power the redstone, power the repeater, power this block. And then this uh, dropper should exit the item. So let's put... Uh, yeah, let's put down cobblestone here. Okay, so it enters the dropper. Okay, so I'm guessing this one isn't the right one or the right way around. Yep, yeah, there we go. Why is it still on? Because there are more than one item. In oh, that might be a problem. Yeah, that's a bit of a problem. It stays on. Because, as far as I knew, this would only get one tick, power the block, and then exit whatever's inside. Oh, now the hoppers are jamming as well. That's awesome. Yeah, that's not gonna work. <coughs> because, oh I know, um, this block is also powering this hopper, so it doesn't uh, output. So I should do it the other way around. Yeah, I'm going to figure this out. I'm going to make it work. It just has to. I mean, how hard can it be? I've been building fusion reactors on Feed the Beast like there's no tomorrow there we go Boop. okay so when we add a couple of items here it stays on yeah okay I'm going to figure this out and I will be right back Okay, so I figured out what was going wrong. Uh, basically, the dropper, wait, hopper, yeah, hopper would keep feeding items into the dropper uh, faster than it could expel them. So uh, that would jam it. So now, I'm going to, yeah, I just added this dropper hop, hopper here. Um going to do it again, like this, then the repeater into this block here. And the trick is very simple. Um, just add one redstone here, and that's it. So now when an item goes into... Oh, that's not good. 
Yeah, okay, so like this. Boop. There we go. So when an item is thrown in here, it will uh, trigger the comparator, which will power this block, which will power the redstone, which will power the repeater, which will power this block. And this block will power the dropper and this redstone. And while this redstone is turned on, this hopper cannot uh, put items in the dropper, so that will prevent it from jamming. So this little bit of redstone here, very important. Okay, so that's uh, one level up. And by the looks of things, I do not have enough supplies, but we'll see how it goes. One, two, three, four. So yeah, I'm going to have to make two more. Hi, Marius. You're on TV. Um, I have a crafting table with me, so I'll just put it somewhere in the way and then make some more droppers. Boop, boop. Like so. Okay, and then we can place chests on here. So that's going to be awesome. Marius! You'd better fix that. <laughs> yeah, we should probably make it a rule. If, uh, if a creeper blows up next to you, it's your fault. <laughs> uh, that rule is going to be so bad for me. Um, anyway. So uh, we can get items from this dropper into that one. And then I need to probably step sideways because I cannot place a comparator on top of a comparator. So I'm going to do it over here. Do I have stone? Yes, I do. And some redstone. Okay, so Smooth stone, comparator, and cobblestone, redstone, repeater, cobblestone, and then that's another circle. And then the next one, I think, can be like the first. So, comparator, and cobblestone block, redstone, then a repeater, and another cobblestone block. So I'm using the cobblestone block to indicate that these blocks will be powered. This, that's just for me to uh, remember how it works because by the time I get out of here I will have probably forgotten how this thing works. <laughs> okay, so we're up here and then which way are we going? To the side um so that's up there then the comparator cobblestone redstone oops that's not good that's not good at all uh oh That's pretty bad. Yeah, all the redstone gone. Oh man, crapper. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to put down... Repeater, redstone, cobblestone. Hmm, I wonder how much is actually gone. Oh, that's not too bad, probably. No, we're good. We're good. Okay. 
I do have to put some torches in here so I don't get surprised by a creeper uh, yeah, this needs a repeater Boop. circle back, circle back, circle back I should have brought some ladders that would probably be, have been a smart thing to do <laughs> yeah okay um, I'm going to finish this up and then I will see you at the surface alright I have finished the item elevator and it's working and right now I'm looking around to see if there are any more creepers because I've been having some creeper problems here uh, they can open the door obviously so we may have to do something with a lever on the side or I don't know think something uh, or use wooden doors of course um, okay so the chest is empty right now and I'm going to throw in some stone, some stairs. And then they're going down into the trench. Do -do 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 -do. And below it you can still see some uh, of the redstone stuff. Oh man, those things are turning crazy. Or could it be the redstone powering the doors? <laughs> That'd be crazy. <laughs> anyway, we have stone brick stairs in our chest. So this is working. So uh, yeah, all that's uh, left right now is to uh, chop some trees and then wait for saplings to fall. And the saplings and everything else that uh, drops into the water should have end up on inside the chest automatically so it should make our work a lot easier and it was nice to build I mean it's not like uh, Feed the Beast where you have machines that actually do all this for you they plant the saplings and chop the trees and before you know it you have uh, one million saplings but yeah it's still uh, it's nice I like it Okay, uh, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, if you did, then please uh, leave a comment, like the video, subscribe. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below or send me a private message. It's all good. And I will do my best to get uh, back to you. Alright, see you guys next time. Oh, uh, before I go, that clapping sound, there it is, it's the fence. Remember that block I removed and water was rushing in? That's this block below. And whenever an item passes, it's being powered. And so it also activates uh, this fence gate here. So yeah, it's uh, kind of uh, an unintentional alarm. So you know something is being put into the chest. Uh, there we go, some oak wood just dropped in some saplings so yeah it's uh, it's awesome I made something in vanilla minecraft that actually works and uses redstone Woo!